This just in, breaking news, Coach Prime Colorado Buffalo just lost their defensive tackle, young, promising freshman. We're going to talk about that in a second, so let's get to it. It's one thing when you lose a player, and he's been very productive. Uh, you lose a player that has had a lot of snaps and all of those things. But it's another when there's off the field issues or on the field issue, however you want to call it, issues in general, and he decides to leave. One thing you don't have to worry about is that problem anymore. And, of course, someone like Coach Prime, as he always say, he will let someone else deal with that. In fact, Bishop Thomas has just entered the transfer portal. This just comes in on today. Now, Bishop Thomas did play a lot of snaps for us last season, but I don't feel like it's going to impact the defense because he haven't practiced with us for months and I just want to let you guys understand that right now. Now, he is a young freshman. I do feel like his situation is a little bit different than Kamani McClain. You know, you didn't hear about Bishop Thomas not showing up to meetings on time, not going to practice and all of those things. It just was off the field issues. And still to this day, I don't understand what was the issue in the first place? So I'm not going to sit up here and tell you guys any information that I don't know. So um, I wish the best for Bishop Thomas. I do feel like Bishop Thomas has great upside. He can definitely play the game of football. One of my favorite players, to be honest with you guys, on the defensive front. And I felt like his upside, his size, and the way he played the game so aggressively would have paired up easily with our new defensive line coach, Coach Sapp. And I felt like Coach Sapp could have definitely coached this kid up. This is a kid with, a, as far as a freshman that has three more years of eligibility. So, you know, someone like that would have been good um, for our defensive line. But it's unfortunate sometimes things happen. I don't really know specifically what happened, what was the reason why Bishop Thomas was suspended in the first place. But I want to give this news out to you guys because, as I said before, Bishop Thomas did play over 100 snaps for this defense. So I can't not just say that he wasn't productive or I cannot say he wasn't a big key of Coach Prime Colorado Buffalo's defense last season. He definitely was. Will not be missed, as I said before, because we do have plenty of replacements that have been doing very well, um, including even in the spring game. So drop a comment. Let me know what you guys think about Bishop Thomas, man. How do you guys feel? If you guys know any information, because I really haven't had much information as far as why he's suspended spinning in the first place if you guys know drop in the comments and let me know and drop a comment and let me know if you guys uh you know if you guys like this video and if you guys like the video definitely like subscribe to the channel peace